This is the most summer spring day I've ever been a part of. I mean, it looks like summer, it feels like summer. It can't really look like a season, technically, unless it's fall. But it looks like, uh, well, no, it feels like summer. It's very, very hot outside. There's not many clouds in the sky. This morning there were a lot, and yesterday, uh, obviously, there were quite a bit. But A321, or at the tennis court, if you could not already tell. And wonderful, directly overhead. And that's the reason I came out here, because there is a big parade of aircraft flying directly overhead. Although now they're going to start to turn earlier and earlier, now that I decide to come out. They've been flying directly over for two and a half hours, but as soon as I get out here, as soon as I decide to be productive and come out here and watch them, guess what they decide to do? That's right, not show up. Also, UPS 5540 was doing something. I don't know what the heck it was doing in Charlotte, but it was in Charlotte. So it's going to be coming from this way. So I don't know if it's going to turn way down there like all the other scallywags do or what. I don't know what it's going to do. It's rather unfortunate. We have a, uh, I don't know what the heck this is. I could probably rest on this wall here. I think I uh, mentioned this before that I rest on this sometimes. Oh god, I didn't see this. There's a CRJ. It was like right on top of me and I didn't notice. I did not know the battery in the camera was full. I charged and brought another battery just because I didn't know that this one was full, dang it. Actually, no, I remember now, because it was like a... My battery died yesterday while I was filming in the morning. And, uh... After... God, I don't even I don't even know what I'm talking about. I'm just there's an A321 coming. But the battery died yesterday, so I decided, hmm, why not why don't I just go ahead and uh put the battery that was already charging in. Oh god, there's a line. This is a 752. No, but uh I decided to give myself a uh, uh endless charged batteries. There's a contrail up here. Contrails are more interesting when you have a camera lens. Oh god, did you hear that 7.5? Unleashing its inner A320. But here it is! Directly over winglet-less. Love to see the winglet-less ones. God, it's rumbling the ground. Making quite a bit of racket. Okay, let's see what the- Oh, this look- This is an A320. I was gonna say this looks big, but it's not. Probably an American. It looks like a 319. Oh no, this is 5540, the A300. 752 just made a weird noise behind me. Oh god, yes. Oh, this is gonna be great, perfect redemption for uh, last time, because I don't know if you guys remember, but last time. Oh, you can see the engine spinning too. No, but last time, 5540 decided it was gonna be behind the clouds. It's very high. But I don't care, I haven't seen an A300 directly over since 2021, June 31st, 2021 to be exact. I know that because I was making a video that day. Oh god, yeah. Thank you, UPS 5540. Oh, listen to it. That's what I'm talking about. Every single day, UPS 5540 brings something special to the table. The A300-600F. Oh, we're gonna get a perfect view of it while it turns to on the bank. Oh, yeah, you can see the, uh, well, the ailerons, I guess. I don't... Oh, yeah. It almost looks like it's in a nosedive from here. Yes! Okay, come on, focus. There we go. Good. Awesome. I was going to say good stuff, but... how oh, it's going to go behind the trees. Ah, oh, thank you, 5540. That was awesome! Okay, what do we have here? Uh, is it a Southwest or uh, ERJ? Looks like an American. I haven't seen too many ERJs lately. What was that? I think it was a, a Delta Jet. 
not going to Atlanta, or at least I hope it wasn't planning on coming to Atlanta. This must have a wicked tailwind, because look at this. It's like crazy. Maybe I can zoom all the way out and get a better angle of it. Yeah, it's going pretty fast is the point. And it's already on the bank. Oh wait, I can get 55-40 on the, uh, on the final. Since I was already coming over here, I don't know if it's already past that point, but hopefully not, because it does take a while to get out of the trees. It's probably already passed. There is something pretty big coming. I'm gonna keep the camera on whatever it is coming. And I'm gonna, it's a 763 it looks like, but I'm gonna focus myself on that final because I know it's going to be on the south side because it's cargo and where else would cargo be other than the south cargo ramp I'm going to try to put a little bit of focus into this although I do hear some rumbling coming from the uh, final oh yeah there it is way over there sheesh my god is that like runway 28 or something Get back on the 763 in a second. Uh, 763 is trying to give me a show. Thank you, 763, with the Delta Belly 2. And 5540 is officially gone. Oh, that sounds awesome. Listen to it. Oh, God. oh look at the moon. Oh, the moon looks real big. I don't know if that's just because I never see it rise these days or what, but. Oh my god, it's out of focus. I don't know why I said it like that with kind of a odd voice. That's how I talk on the bus when I'm doing this. And okay, we have a uh, contrail, looks like a spirit. Every single time I see a contrail, it's always a spirit. It's never any other airline. Oh god, okay, 717. I feel like I said 7-7 scene. 7, 7 Just in case. Oh yeah, look how awesome that looks. When it's in focus, camera. Okay, you can see the smoke. Looks like a no delta belly. Which is perfectly fine by me. Sorry, I was looking behind me. Let's see if we get the 7-6-3 on final. Which we probably will. Oh yeah, 717s always make this type of noise. MD-95 also, uh... You can also call it that. I like calling it both. But listen to it. Yeah, it sounds like it's trying to be three different jets at once. Okay, final time. I don't actually know, uh... Where the 763's at. But there's traffic over there, so I know it can't, couldn't have gone far from that point. Okay, MD-95, getting back in the spotlight. I just like saying MD once again. I miss having something to call an MD. And there's nothing on the south final. There is this. I don't know what this is. It looks like a... It's another spirit! Why is spirit haunting me? Truly is the evil spirit haunting me. Night and day. Speaking of night and day, the moon can't decide whether it wants to come out at night or day. As you can tell by its appearance in the uh, somewhat evening light. Is it evening yet? Would you consider this evening? This is what I'd call really late afternoon. <laughs> evening is, to me at least, is actually when the sun like sets kind of like from when it first crests the hill oh my god is this the continental stub it is but it's the new continental stub it's the blue continental stub It's the new blue continental stub! 
Oh, yes, I didn't think I'd see this. I thought the Continental Stub already ran its course for today. Oh, and it's a Continental Stub Max, too. Oh, awesome. Okay, I think I missed any chance I had of getting a 763 since this is the 717 slash MD95. I think, unless it's like a CRJ. No, it is a CRJ, I think. I don't know. Camera keeps going out of focus. Okay, back to the Connie stub. Continental stub. Okay, we're not gonna get that back in focus. The moon is becoming uh, ever more present in the sky. Camera, stop! God, I need to turn back a single autofocus again. So it'll only focus once. Because I'm getting tired of this. I can take a good picture of it because you can actually kind of control the focus. Was it? You can adjust the autofocus, kind of. Okay, A320. And I think it actually is an A320 this time. Yes, it's a jet blue, I'd assume. No, it's Delta again. I'm glad it's kind of offset so I could see that. But there should be a jet blue coming too. Okay, now it's got the delta belly, so now, now it's easy, easier to tell. Checking the final again. I lost it. Okay, back into frame. Come back into focus. I was gonna say it's coming back into focus. Now it's coming back into focus, but it wasn't. Barely making any of its whistles. You sound like a regular jet, sorta. Oh wait, no, that is a 763. Yeah, co oh come on. I'm pointing in the completely wrong direction. I'm sorry, 763. I'll give you your screen time now. Yeah. Okay. You're done. And there seems to be nothing else coming. So I can try one last desperate attempt to look at the moon. God, it gets perfectly in focus and then it, like, just tries to find something else. I'm gonna turn single autofocus back on. But the problem is, I did that one time and then I tried filming a jet and almost uh, screwed up because it was still on. Fortunately, I started filming pretty early on and I realized. Is this another Continental Stub? It's another Continental Stub! I like how the lighting makes it look like it's a uh, US Airways. What the heck is this? Is this an A318 for crying out loud? Okay, no. Two Continental Stubs in one sitting? Almost in a row? Oh my god, and it's another Continental Stub Max. The new blue Continental Stub. But there's two of them. They multiplied. They're capable of reproducing, and I did. I wasn't aware. Okay, I need to stop with the stupid, unfunny humor, and just focus on the Connie stub. Thank you, Continental stub. Two times for the first time ever. That's uh, almost two times in a row. I think I already said that. Okay, I'm gonna focus on you again, and I think that might actually be the 717 from earlier. Yeah, because if the 763 just came by, then this is the, the 717. It's kind of weird how they're uh, traveling that distance on the downwind. Okay, can the can we look at the moon again? I had to. Scratch my arm, my wrist. Yes! I did it! I guess it's finally become vivid enough in the sky to be available for me to capture. And there goes a car, too. 739 ER with the splits and something back here that I don't know the name of yet. Oh, it's big. It's big. It looks like an A330, maybe? 
I'm gonna guess A330 from Amsterdam. Or sorry, Amsterdam. I don't think many people would care if I called it Amsterdam. Just waiting for it to get in focus, which is surprisingly kind of working as long as I keep my hand steady. Which is putting pressure on me, which is making me want to shake. Oh god, okay, I'm getting to the point where I can actually see it in real life now. So I'm gonna zoom in and out a few times. It's gonna go through some branches and probably ruin all my, uh, soil all my hard work of focusing on it. Come on, look. Yes, we can see the engine spinning again. Beautiful, isn't it? Maybe we can see the pilots? No, we can't see the pilots. We could if the sun was shining on them the right way. We could see their silhouettes. But that's also a little bit dumb. Okay. And it's also not an interesting time to look at the pilots on the downwind when the autopilot's doing all the work. Oh, it's an A330! Are you a 200? No, it's a 300. Dang it! Either way, from Amsterdam, I love Delta 75 Heavy or whatever the hell heavy it is this time. What do we have coming next? Maybe it... I assume it's a little annoying that I'm just, uh... Moving past that quickly. But there's a lot of things coming, okay? Obviously not now. But there is the moon. That I finally got to focus about ten minutes ago. It's looking rather pink now. A pink moon. This can be the thumbnail. Although, these days I just let YouTube make the thumbnail automatically for me. I don't really care. Uh, you know. So it's probably gonna do something dumb, like usual. I wanna see if, uh, I wanna see if Turkish 31 kilo, or uh, 31, I guess, heavy, actually, uh, decides to come this way this time. Oh, look how awesome it looks. Hey, Delta! You might want to use this. A uh, still shot of this. Not this, come too close. Wait. Oh, yeah. Okay, no, but Delta! Somebody call Delta and tell him to use this. Oh, it's gonna be turning. This is gonna be perfect. There's something behind me, though. I don't care. Oh, yes. Okay. Somebody tell Delta to use this now. Someone tell Delta to use this. Right this instant. Okay, it's gonna... Gonna go away, uh, behind the trees, and... No, Delta can use that for a promo, though. Oh my god, it's still turning! Delta, I got a new promo for you! Okay, uh, 739. Direct overhead. No Delta belly, which is a good thing now. That means it's a, uh... It's a king among 737s and Delta jets in general. Oh, I want to see this go into the sunset, too. Everything is just fabtastic. This video is going to be damn hour long. Don't even have to cut off the video these days. Because back in the olden days, I think I already said it enough. But the furthest I could zoom in was about uh, to here. Because it was about real life. I think there's a little bit more than that. Because it looks more zoomed out the way this camera screen is. But no, this is about as far as I could zoom in with my old camera. So things would get... Not out of the old camera, but the tablet camera. From... Basically last year and on back. There's a car. But no. So things would get really, really boring. Especially with the terrible quality. After we passed it. Oh, what's this? Something going to Fulton County. I'm not quite sure what it is, because once it... Oh my god, I was out of focus. That's what I hate about those. It passed by so quickly and so low, because obviously we're a lot closer to Fulton County Airport than uh, downwind Atlanta. 
Come on now. There we go. Good. Dang it. That was me that messed that up that time. Oh, but I redeemed myself. I'm redeeming it. I can focus. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna strafe away from my laziness and actually make a custom thumbnail for this one. Cause that was that was pretty awesome, I'll tell you what, man. Okay, we have a Kurge. A CRJ 900 LR. Where are the 200s? We're getting to the end of the CRJ 200 line for Delta. I, so this is when I want to start filming more of them. This almost looks like a 700. It's not, though. It gave me hope for a second, but... Uh, getting a better glimpse of it, it's just a CRJ900 that looks weird. Probably because of the lighting. Once again, hey, and the moon is looking uh, more stable. Come on now, camera. Think about the viewers. Oh, that looked real good. Wait. Yeah. All right, CRJ 900LR. I'm gonna take a picture of this one instead because the sun is uh, beginning to actually set and go away now, unfortunately. So uh, that 739 may or may not have been the last uh, sunset image, promo image, let's just call it, for today. Enjoying our loud 739s. Well, A320 something back here at a assume okay ignoring that now because it's not gonna focus I just uh, this is a 738 uh, but no I just uh, got probably my last shot of a sunset aircraft for crying out loud why are you so loud clam up a bit Jesus H Christ on a popsicle stick Okay, no, but um, I possibly the last capture of an aircraft in the sunset, because as you can see, the sunset. Whoa! The A320 just made its noise. You probably couldn't hear it. But it made its whooping, because the 738 is so loud. Oh, listen. It kind of redeemed. Um... Are you feeling okay, A320? This is a Neo, I think, too, so... They've definitely got that, uh, speed break whooping. There's the moon. 738, I'm gonna try to get maybe a few, um... A few last jets. So you can see the sunset isn't as, uh, vivid, though, as it... was previously. Say A320 is making a lot of racket. I not like the way the 737 was, where it's actually just making a lot of noise. I mean, like, it's making weird noises. Okay, here we go. It's turning. It's twinning. Oh, yeah, never mind. This is looking good still. Oh, yes. Oh, it's got a stupid-ass Wi-Fi hub on the top. That ruined it. Okay, where's the A320? Neo, actually, too. Okay. There's a 738. Okay, what's next? It's back a long way. Okay, uh, A321 departing. Only at about 16,000 feet. Pretty low, if you ask me. Oh, what's this? What is it doing? And where is it coming from? Oh, is this the World Champions? It's the World Champions 738! Oh god, focus camera. No, I feel like this uh, already passed by. So, a second arrival for that. Sounds pretty high throttle, too. Alright. Uh, okay, A320 Neo is uh, turning now. If Delta doesn't take up my offer, at least Spirit might. 
need to make sure there's no cars coming. And that was pretty pointless considering I'm on this side of the road. But okay, 738. World Champions 738, actually. I was right, it was the Braves. There's full zoom. Sorry about my being so shaky. I'm not checking the street this time. And oh my god. It looks like there's some sort of accessory. Under the belly. Okay, there's not. It was just something weird. And there was something coming. On the downwind. Further this way. I don't know where it's at though. I don't know where it went. So I'll kind of try to focus on the world champion 738. Which is no longer within sight because it hasn't turned yet onto its base. So we'll take a look at something on final. I'd assume it's another 7.3. It looks like the 7.3.8 from previously. And yes, it is the loud ass 7.3.8. Now it's gone. Completely. And, oh my god. It's even smaller than a red, just a Cessna Citation. Under a red, but also above a red. If you're talking about, uh... Well, I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Competing with the 738 now for the noise emissions. And I hear something over here. I don't think there actually is anything. But yeah, that's what I saw. It disappeared into what looks like uh, some fake clouds. And by fake clouds, I just mean wimpy clouds. There aren't really anything. I'm wearing a jacket out here. It's about 70 something degrees out here, and I'm wearing a jacket. Also, what's this? Probably some sort of very high jet that took off. Yes, it is. From the ground, you can only see light since it's about uh, 20,000 feet up now. And this is the A320neo, I'd assume, from just a second ago. Yes, it is. Oh my god, a contrail just went through the moon. But dang it, I missed the end of the trail. Okay, we get a nice view of the moon here. That's something everybody wants to see when they see somebody uh, screwing around with the camera of this camera zoom range. They like to see pictures of the moon. I'd rather see pictures of jets. Oh, yes, I think this is Delta 26 Heavy from Seoul, South Korea. As you may know, that's where Seoul is at. Uh, in the meantime, let's look at this A319 over here. And okay, in the meantime, let's look at this moon over here. Yes, wondrous, great. Camera will focus on it now because it's bright enough. And Delta 26 Heavy is still lost back there. Okay, let's look at this departure. We have a departure. A321. And 26 Heavy. I want to turn slowly so it can get out. It should be out right about now. Yes, good. That was good. That was bad. But that was good. And there it is. It's either Delta 26 or 296. 296 would be from, uh, Let's see, Tokyo Haneda, that's what 296 would be, from, and now it's going to go behind the trees. I think it goes to 26 heavy, or 296 heavy, once again, I don't know, and whatever in the hell this is, it's a 738, thought it was smaller than that, and okay, it looks, it's looking like the evening is cleared up, we've cleared the evening. The sunset has uh, officially, well, the sun has officially parted, and as have the uh, the pretty-looking clouds. 
and the uh, the uh, Delta promotional photos. So now I think I'm going to be heading home. So thank you everybody for watching, and I hope to see you sometime in the near future. Which is funny because the video I made yesterday is going to uh, come out after the video I make today. So the next time I'll see you is yesterday, technically. But it doesn't matter. Good night.